Hey guys, in this video, I do a two year review of the Everyday Backpack in Midnight Blue by Peak Design. Now this video is not sponsored. I paid for this uh, out of pocket. Uh, I didn't have any sort of input by Peak Design. They probably don't even know I exist. So uh, uh, this is the honest opinion on this backpack right here. And this one is the Midnight Blue color. They also have a charcoal color an ash color and black. I chose the midnight blue and the 30 liter. Uh, I thought it was a good choice. Uh, I am 5'10", 185 pounds. So you could see um, what this looks like uh, next to me. So buying it at first, I didn't have a lot of camera gear. So I didn't have all this stuff to put in there. But like the name implies, it's an everyday backpack, so it's not only for camera gear, it's for other things as well. I have a 14 inch uh, MacBook Pro M1. This is uh, well protected in this bag right here. Uh, anytime it's in this backpack, uh, I do feel like it's really safe, so it puts me at ease. The exterior is weather resistant. What I also like about the look of this backpack is that it doesn't scream camera bag. Most people don't even know it is a camera bag company, Peak Design. So that was something that was uh, appealing to me. That's something that I was looking for. I didn't wanna be walking around with something that looked like I was carrying some really expensive equipment. You know, you kinda wanna just blend in, and kinda be low key. So uh, this is the 30 liter. Uh, they also offer it in a 20 liter. Uh, I thought it was a good choice to go with the big one because even though it's more money, uh, you, you can fit more things in it. You know, you grow into it. So, so let's say you don't have a lot of camera gear, right? You're just starting off. Well, you're gonna be thankful that you have that extra room once you start getting gear because it does fill up quick. The 30 liter, if you're gonna be carrying it onto an airplane and traveling with it, you want as much room as possible because when this is all full, it just barely fits underneath the seat. One of the great features here is the deep pockets right here that collapse well and then they hug the side of the backpack really well. It also has a, a spring lander here they have magnets on the back so they don't flap around so when, in, when it's not in use they stay close to the back it has a really nice look and a really good feel to it nice leather you can tell it's quality strap here and the bottom of it is padded and it's very comfortable very comfortable to hold when it's heavy and you're carrying this around the airport or um, or when you're hiking yeah it, it's really it's not digging into your hand you know it's uh, really comfortable so that's that's a good thing whenever you zip something shut here it really feels like it's zipped shut so it kind of gives you peace of mind knowing I mean just the sound of the zippers two years later even after uh, zipping it, you know, hundreds of times open and close, the, the zippers haven't aged a bit. All right, guys, thank you for watching the video. Consider subscribing if this is sort of content that you enjoy watching. I have some more reviews on my channel. I have one of the Everyday Sling by Peak Design, the 10 liter, and uh, some other ones as well. So uh, yeah, that's it for now. We'll talk to you in the next video. Take care.